Hey guys, Abs here. In this video, I'm going to be picking several lucky winners for the WP Serp Fuel Enterprise Plus Edition. Now, just before I do that, I want to thank each and every single one of you that came along and watched this video, that downloaded the Serp Fuel technique and understood it, and everyone that actually came along and left a comment on here as well. We got in total, we got 134 comments, guys. Um, they were excellent comments. We didn't have to moderate any single one of them, um, and so all the comments you see here are the comments that were left by our users. Um, and we actually picked up a tip or two from the comments um, themselves so come along and try and read them if you get the time to um, and maybe them tips we can actually save for another video um, further down the line um, so what I'm going to do is before I actually pick the three lucky winners um, I want to actually take you over to some questions I want to cover um, which I actually picked up from here as well um, and I believe many of you guys are going to want to know the answers too so um, the very first question is, is it newbie friendly? Absolutely guys, as long as you know how to work with WordPress, you know how to make a post on your WordPress site um, and you can follow some video tutorials and a PDF guide, um, then you're not gonna have any problems working with the plugin. The plugin has actually been designed to be totally newbie friendly and as long as you know how to work as long as you know how to make a WordPress post, then let's just say you're gonna be able to work with this plugin as well. It really is that simple. Okay, question number two. Will it work on any WP site or any WordPress site? Yes, it should do. We've tested it on multiple versions of WordPress. We've tested it on multiple with multiple different themes um, and we've actually tried to break the plugin, um, but we haven't found any issues. And one of the reasons behind that is because the plugin doesn't change the way your WordPress site looks or feels to users or to yourself. Um, the only thing it does is adds another feature in there that allows you to create these fueled posts um, and um, so far we've found it work on every single WordPress site and should you find any issues working with this then of course we are here to make sure that we can put it right and make it work for your site but as mentioned guys it doesn't change your structure so if you've got a WordPress site that's old and you, you know um, that works beautifully already um, then WP SERP fuel isn't going to change that it's only going to add extra value you onto that and it should work out of the out of the box okay question number three is it a standalone plugin yes it is guys you don't need any other plugin to work with this as long as you've got a WordPress site then this is gonna work um, there are different versions of this plugin guys um, but other than that this is a standalone plugin um, question number four server resources and requirements so this will actually work on any shared server any VPS any dedicated server it should work on Windows and Linux servers as well um, and in regards to the server resources then the only time it's gonna actually do something is when you're actually creating the fueled posts other than that it never does anything else it doesn't have any cron jobs or anything like that so it's not it doesn't hog any resources whatsoever um, and um, yeah so you know what you shouldn't have any problems whatsoever in fact we actually test many of our plugins on servers like HostGator and shared servers just to make sure users that are actually working on servers like them don't face any issues and with the Enterprise Plus Edition it actually allows you to make multiple fueled posts for multiple posts at the same time um, and we've managed to do this for 10 15 posts um, on shared servers guys so I'm hoping that should answer your questions that you know what it doesn't really take a lot of resources whatsoever um, okay question number five how much work is involved to create the posts well there's not a lot of work involved whatsoever guys in fact with the enterprise plus edition we have a video mode which I'll talk you through in a moment which is like a set it and forget it lazy man's way of creating these posts um, however in regards to how much work is actually um, involved to creating these posts guys um, then it's a matter of, it's as simple as creating a post. Have your content ready. We tell you how to get this content. You can either spin the content or you can spin your parent articles or you can use content from Article Builder. Um, but as long as you stick to some quality guidelines and make sure that your content is fully readable and humanly readable, um, then you should be totally fine. And it literally takes seconds to make these posts, guys. And I, I actually show you on the sales page live demonstrations of me making these posts in front of you as well. Okay, um, question number six, where do the fueled pages reside? They reside on your site, on your domain, on your server. Um, the only thing is, is that they're just not linked to from your main WordPress site, but they're still all created through your main WordPress backend, guys. So they all reside on your site. Um, question number seven, do you have any, do you do any external links to the fueled posts? Yes, I do. I use plugins, sorry, I use the feed generated by the WP Serp Fuel plugin and I automatically build links to it every time 
time a new fueled, fueled post is added to the feed um, by using SociSynd. Um, I add the feed to SociSynd and when SociSynd finds that a new entry has been added to the feed, um, it will go out there and get social signals. Um, you don't have to use SociSynd. You don't have to get external links. Um, you can use things like if this, then that, or you can go out there and manually build the links yourself. Um, but I highly recommend you build links to them. And if you're wondering how everything absolutely fits in together, guys, um, then I'd highly recommend you come over and read and watch these videos and read the manual, which will explain everything to you. Okay. Okay, is it possible to, question number eight, is it possible to create curated video posts? Yes, as mentioned just a moment ago, let me just quickly see how long this video has taken. Okay, um, as mentioned just a moment ago, um, in the Enterprise Plus Edition, you have a video mode feature. Now, what this video mode feature allows you to do is it allows you to go out, it allows you to go and add your anchor text that you want to create for the internal linking. Um, and it will then go and it allows you to select video mode and it, and it will then go and visit YouTube, pull back related videos, pull back the titles, create the posts for you, embed the video for you and link back to your main post as well. Um, in fact, it also allows you to introduce each videos um, with spin syntax as well so that you can keep everything totally unique and make your field posts look much and make your field posts have much more content as well. Um, so you know what, it does allow you to do it and it allows you to do it in a set it and forget it manner. Um, question number nine, can you add and select your own anchor text? Yes, you can guys. You can use Google to find anchor text or you can add anchor text yourself. If you've got the Enterprise Plus Edition, it will allow you to search Google, Yahoo and Bing. Um, and of course, you can always add your own anchor text as well. Um, and the big question number 10 is how much is it going to cost guys? Um, well, as you fully, as you guys are fully aware, um, our products are always affordable. Um, and when we actually have the special release of our products, so like the launch period for the first five days or the first seven days after this gets released then you're going to be able to pick it up for an incredibly affordable price what i will say is that um, a single site license is going to be as cheap as nine bucks um, and the rest you can find out when we actually go live guys so it is super cheap guys um, we're not here to you know um make this something that's not going to be affordable by you guys we wanted to outline the strategy to you show you how the strategy works and then present a solution to you that everyone can afford and take away um, from this but like i said guys um after the launch period it is going to be significantly increasing in price so anyway these are the questions answered so now let's go over um and pick the lucky winners so i'm on a website here called random.org um, i'm going to click on refresh and in total, um, we got 134 comments. But if you actually come down here, guys, you can see there's a couple of duplicate comments, not duplicate comments, but there's a couple of users that um, made two comments, for example, here. So we didn't add them in there twice. Um, so in this CSV file that holds all of the comments, um, you'll notice that we got 131 in total. Um, so I'm going to put, I'm going to pick three lucky winners between numbers one and 131. Um, and we're going to be setting you up with a license and we'll automatically email you or our team will email you with the license detail. So our very first lucky winner is number 100. Um, so number 100, I don't have the email addresses here. They're on my server um, or on my back end. Um, this is David. David, this is the one that actually left two messages on here. Um, and David's comment was nice way to use blind pages to create category page silos within the overall silo structure. Would love to have a shot at putting this into practice. Fantastic, David. You're our first lucky winner. And what I'm going to do is um, put down David. And I'm going to put down his comment as well. So I know that I don't get mixed up and we have your email in our back end. So David, you're the very first lucky winner. Congratulations. And number winner number two is 61. Comment number 61. Okay, um, Jim Hudson. Jim Hudson, congratulations. Um, your comment was plug in just what I need to free me up from writing great content. Um, so um, Jim Hudson, congratulations. You're going to get an Enterprise Plus license as well. Um, let me just write your name down here. Okay, and our final lucky winner, guys, is number 92. And number 92, we have Glenn. 
fantastic. So Glenn, congratulations. We're gonna have a license set up to you as well. Uh, license set up for you as well. Um, I'm gonna read out your comment as well, Glenn. Your comment was looks like a variation on the link juice process. Did I get it right that the fuel post pages are not linked, are not indexed anywhere? Um, I'm not 100% sure I understand your question, Glenn, um, but what I would advise you um, is you left this comment on the 22nd, which was only yesterday, um, is if you haven't watched these videos here, um, then definitely watch these videos, especially this one here. This one I think we added yesterday, so I'm not sure if your comment was left before adding this video or after adding this video, but this video here will actually show you um, how the fueled posts and pages get linked to from your site, how they get indexed and the and the actual missing link, what we're calling the missing link, which is the RSS feeds. As soon as you understand how the fueled posts work with the RSS feeds and what you do with the RSS feeds, which is all explained in this video, um, then you'll totally understand exactly how this works. But either way, Glenn, you're getting yourself an Enterprise Plus account. Um, so you're gonna be able to put this in practice. You're gonna be able to get the tutorials and everything and know exactly how it works. So our three lucky winners, David, Jim Hudson, and Glenn, congratulations. And to everybody else it looks like we're going to be going live this friday um if anything changes then i'll let you know um if it doesn't guys then it looks like we're going live friday and i'll keep you fully informed via email as well so thank you very much guys and again guys um this is a technique um that's proven it's tried it's tested users are using it if you actually read some of these comments um you'll actually see, understand that users are already doing this um some use multiple plugins to get this effect um our wp serp fuel brings everything together to use just the one plugin to get this effect in fact you know what i don't, I don't even think there's any other plugin that i've seen out there that does anything like wp serp fuel um and i know there's a couple of comments in here here that see some similarities between some plugins but when I actually check them plugins they were totally different altogether um, to really understand WP SERP fuel uh, method then all I can do is advise you to read the PDF guide watch this video watch this video and it should explain everything to you and we've actually got one more video as well um, which is um, about a video that shows the issues that all websites face um, so you can watch that as well so anyway guys I really hope you enjoy um, it enjoyed the SERP fuel technique and I really hope you can join us on Friday um, and get access to WP SERP fuel and I want to congratulate you guys one more time for winning the Enterprise Plus license and for everyone else that has come along and participated um, in this contest so thank you very much and I hope to see you on Friday